This new feature is going to change the way that you organize your email in Outlook and make working with your information so much easier. Microsoft even put a pop-up about it, but I didn't get the significance of it until I started playing with it. So if you take a look at this box, it's telling you that you can custom order your folders. And then if you want to switch back to alphabetical order, go to the settings, right? So all I saw was go to settings and clicked not interested. But the point of this update is you now have greater control over how you organize your folders. So in the past, you had your standard folders. They were at the top and you couldn't change them. Then when you started adding your own folders, they were automatically alphabetized and you couldn't change that either. So the trick that I used to teach was to put a number in front of a folder to force the organization. But you don't even have to do that anymore. What you can do now is go to folders and click on the three dots and then select create new folder from the list and give it a name Then click the check mark to accept it. And the new folder just populates towards the top of the list. And then from here, you can drag and drop it into any order that makes sense to you. I want professional development to be right under my info sessions, which is my webinars. And then, for example, I want archive to be all the way at the bottom because I hardly ever look at it. And you can continue organizing all the folders in a way that makes sense to you. But the cool thing is you can even take things like draft sent items and move them to the bottom now. So you're not stuck with any of the Microsoft pre-organized folders. You can still mark individual folders as favorites to keep the ones you use the most at the top of the page, but there's another update for favorites as well. You can now add group email boxes into your favorites. So instead of having to monitor your email in the inbox and then switch to the groups tab to monitor group emails, you can make the group a favorite and see them all in one place. To do that, click the three dots next to favorites, click add favorite, and on the list, you should see your group mailboxes. If you have a longer list, you might have to search for it. Now, if you're the type of person who prefers to have your folders automatically alphabetized, it's really easy to switch it back. From the ribbon at the top left side of the screen, we're on the Home tab. Click on the View tab, and then in the Layout section, go to Folder Pane. Click the drop down arrow and go to the Select Folder section. By default, Custom Folder Order is selected. You can just switch A to Z, and it's automatically going to put it back into the classic view. If you change your mind later, you can always come back and sort the folders by custom order. Now, I personally have found this has been a huge improvement in my workflow and organization, but tell me in the comments, do you like the alphabetical order or are you planning on trying out the custom sort?